All right, all right, man. Let me tell y'all about the baddest man in boxing, man. I've been telling y'all for a minute, and that baddest dude in boxing is this dude, Arthur Baturbiev. This is a bad son of a gun, folks, and it didn't take for him to do what he just did to Colin Smith to prove that. But what it proved is that you've never seen Colin Smith get folded like this. He may have been defeated by Canelo and this and that, but you ain't never seen him look this bad in trouble. The nodding on the face and then watch him get crushed and then watch his Hall of Fame trainer, former fighter, Buddy McGirt, have to run inside that ring to let that foolish ass ref who was still going into an eight count to let Colum Smith return and possibly be put out on a damn stretcher. But uh, Colum is definitely going to the hospital to be evaluated tonight. But you've seen the baddest man in boxing, man, and that's Arthur Baturbiev, who is a specialist at breaking down fighters. He specializes in that shit. He does this shit with such craftsmanship, man, you would never see it done better. And the only person second to that will probably be uh, uh, Sabril Matias. And, and man, this dude is a bad dude. And the one thing that makes Baturbiev stand out, let me put this out. This dude is a high-level boxer. Many people see what the 100% knockout rates is that thinking that he's some kind of knockout artist, this and that. No, this is one of the most technical boxers you've ever seen within this sport. This is one of the guy who utilizes the jab to effectively break a person down. You can gain a lot of power punching throughout the jab, and this guy showcases that. This guy doesn't have to go out here winding up punches, trying to knock pers a person out with one punch, trying to knock him out in one round, or looking just to land the one punch after losing multiple rounds. This is a guy who intelligently sets everything up off of the jab. <clears throat> the jab is everything in a Baturbia fight. And this is a guy who has 100% stoppages, not looking in there to just crush you with Big power shots, it's the jab. He varies the jab. He puts the jab in all these different places. This dude is a high-level boxer. Now, people keep saying about Bivol being a better boxer and this and that. But when I hear people say that, I'm like, y'all think that Paterviev is some knockout artist, some slugger or something like that? Are y'all watching the fights? This guy specializes in this shit. And boxing, the effective use of the jab. The power of the jab, man. You don't see this shit done any better, man. And the other thing that stands out with Baturbiev, Baturbiev ain't a guy looking for popularity contests. He ain't a guy going out here talking about how many pay-per-views he sells and what his opponent doesn't sell and his opponent not being a B-side and him an A-side. It ain't none of that shit. Make the fights. Let's get this shit done. And this is the thing that separates this dude. Why I like him more than any of these fighters out here. Because this dude goes out here to get this shit done. Doesn't fancy around with none of this shit. Ain't with none of this pop, uh, uh, K-pop looking shit that many of these American fighters that you see who worry about the A side, B side, who like them, who hating, who all this other shit, what they saying about me. <clears throat> Who don't like me, then they got their fan cheerleaders, their fan male cheerleaders who also run around behind. You don't need no you tell you, you a hater and you this and that. You against the man and it he ain't got nobody pushing that kind of shit. It's make the fucking fights, win, lose, a fucking draw, and he's stopping everybody. This is the baddest dude in this sport. Now, many people be like, many of you ignorant motherfuckers come here, no, nah, it's Bud. Bud is a top badass dude too. Sabril Mati is another top badass dude. There's other, but I'm speaking upon who I view as my favorite fighter in this sport is this motherfucker right here doing his fucking thing, destroying motherfuckers and not make and not overdoing it. This fool destroying people with patience. It don't get no better than that, man. But that's all I got, folks. I'm going to catch you on the next one. Peace.